We often hear the question, what's happening in the office world? What are you seeing on the ground? The common theme is that all things are not created equal. Historically, office has been something that trades on some level of an average of either side of the best and the rest. What we're seeing in the market now is a much more nuanced picture than we've ever seen before. This bifurcation that's happening specific to office and even more specifically here in the US is probably deeper and more acute than we've ever seen. The fundamental reason we're seeing challenges to the overall office market today come down to two factors. The first is we're in a period of a pullback in overall demand. The second is this changing dynamic of what office tenants value today and how quality is defined. The amount of vacancy that we're seeing in the market today is disproportionately aggregated in the lower 30% of buildings. 90% of the vacancy in the US office market today sits within that cohort of assets. At the same time, where we're seeing this huge dislocation is we're still achieving some of the highest rents really across the globe in our office business in the best buildings. And that is a dynamic we have not seen in the past. We're seeing more blue chip tenants and the highest rents we've achieved across our new developments, and that's on a global basis. The office tenant today is looking for something very different than they had in the past. And what that means is the best buildings continue to achieve higher rents, more demand, and more attractiveness to our tenant base than they ever have before. The largest companies around the world are going to continue to demand top tier office. 